In this video, I show you how to hide apps on your iPhone and also hide them in the app library as well. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like. And let's go and jump straight into this guide. The way you probably know of hiding apps on your iPhone is by holding your finger on it, going and pressing on remove app at the top, and then going and pressing remove from home screen. But as you already know, that's just gonna appear in your app library. So if you go and search for it, as you can see, it's going to go and appear uh, just like so. So if you want to go and remove it from your app library as well, then this is the guide for you. So to do that, what you need to do is go and open up the settings app just like so. Then what you need to do is scroll down to see screen time. It's currently in the second section of your settings. It may be different, but you can always go and use the search function at the top of settings to go and find it. Anyways, go and tap on it. Then what you need to do is go and tap on content and privacy restrictions, just like so. And then once you're on the content and privacy restrictions page, we've got two different options. So if you want to go and disable an app by Apple, for example, something like FaceTime, then go and tap on allowed apps. And as you can see, I've got my FaceTime up there. I can then go and switch off FaceTime. And as you can see, it will then disappear just like that. And you also won't be able to find it in your app library if I go and type FaceTime, just like that. But if you want to do like a third party app like Instagram or something like that, then what you need to do is come back to the content and privacy restrictions page, press on content restrictions, and then go and tap on apps in this on the allowed store content section. And we've got a few different options here. With hiding third party apps, it's a little bit different. At the moment, you can't just go and switch off individual apps. All you can do is go and filter them by age. For example, if I go and press on four plus apps, this means any apps which are for anyone older than four years old, they're gonna be hidden. So if it was like a 17 plus app, that's not gonna be available. So if I swipe across, as you can see, there's far fewer apps. No, none of my social apps are available. Anything like Instagram is gonna have gone and disappeared, as you can see, and that's literally it. And then if you want to go and access it again, all you need to do is come back to this page here, press allow all or a different age rating, and it'll take a moment for your phone to go and adjust. And your apps may not be appearing on your home screens, but they will be in the app library, and then you'll need to go and add them back to your home screen by holding on the app and then tapping on add to home screen again and then come back to your app library. And as you can see, Instagram is now available again. And that's the best way of hiding apps from your app library and just your entire phone. If you guys found this useful, please go down below and consider subscribing. Peace.